Hey, Barbara Miller with Cycling Strong. So I'm with David from Biomax, uh, and this is a really cool product. I don't know if you guys have looked at wax and how wax can help you on your chain. It actually increases power. Lots of studies out there and a lot of write-ups on it. But I'm going to have David get into details on his product. It's not, you know, it's not as prevalent here in the U.S., and it needs to be more so. So, David, take it away. Tell us why we should be using your product, what's so cool about it, the special things about it, and get into some details. Really educate the viewer. Sure. Well, we have a range of products. Uh, first one's the, uh, the BioLube. Uh, it's a wax lube made with lanolin. Uh, one of the fastest lubes that uh, ever been tested. Uh, 4.13 watts on a chain, so it's going to save at least 2 or 3 watts over most other lubes. Uh, so we've got a uh, nice little feature, a little chain guide here. Uh, just helps the user get it aligned on the chain. So let's talk about that more. So when I'm applying that, let's talk about application. So yep. I use that. Yep. I squirt it on as the chain's going around, yep. then what? Um, so yeah, so being uh, a wax, we need it to set up on the chain, so we recommend people uh, lube the night before they ride. Um, our lube typically will dry overnight, um, and it'll last probably two to three times longer than most other lubes that have been tested. Okay, so um, when you say that, if should I clean, have a brand new clean yeah, chain when I'm sure. doing that? Yeah. I mean, walk these, these, these are all beginners out here. So, sure, sure. So we have a clean chain. Yep. Which yep. is you're doing with? Yeah, so you can clean your chain with our biodegreaser. Um, this is actually a fully natural product, completely made from, derived from plants. Um, and yep, clean your chain. Uh, what we actually prefer is uh, you can either use a mechanical chain cleaner if you just want to uh, clean it really quick, uh, which just means you just pour it in up to the line and run yep. your chain through. If you want to really do a deep clean, you know, we recommend obviously you take your chain off your bike and give it a good scrub. So this will, um, you just wipe this on, it'll take a couple of minutes just to start to eat into all the grease and the dirt and the grime, just a bit of a quick brush. Um, it'll loosen all the dirt, it'll come off. We recommend then just a quick flush um, and then just obviously leave it to dry. Flush with what? Uh, well, you can either flush it with some clean uh, bio wash okay. um, or you can uh, just use some hot soapy water okay. and then either blow that off just let it keep it nice and dry and then apply your lube okay and then when you say apply the lube how much lube are we applying uh well typically on a like literally it's just a couple of laps around your chain basically just quickly as it goes through with the little guide actually what happens is this actually um you know what actually happens is with our little nozzle here it's actually dropping it right where you want it on the rollers yeah. and uh, on the bearings and that then wicks in mm -hmm. and that's what gives us a lot of our performance but yeah a couple of laps around that'll be plenty and okay. then just a quick wipe if you put too much on just keeps it nice and clean and then just wait for it to set up and then you're guaranteed probably the smoothest ride okay yeah and then at that point in time how frequent do I need to how many miles what am I looking for well um, it depends on your type of riding and the conditions you're riding in. Typically on a mountain bike, um, you know, I get 100, 100 miles, probably 425 mile rides. Um, on my road bike, um, you know, you can get good 300 miles easy on it. Okay. Um, and and we've then got, what? Clean it back here again? Go no, through the process? No, what do we do? Uh, well, you know what? You don't need to clean every time you, you apply this. You okay. can probably, you know, you just can keep applying this. Um, again and again. Um, you can probably keep it clean by just giving it a wee wipe, but yeah, de again, depends on the amount of riding you do. Um, okay. If you're riding every day in all sorts of conditions, you'd probably be cleaning once a month, sure. probably, but that's probably all you'd need. All right. We find the lube actually goes better when you, you actually start to build up, a, you know, after a few applications. Um, you know, you'll actually get, you'll just, just notice it'll just even go a lot longer. Okay. Um, all right. Yep. Um, so we have a bio wash as well, which is all natural, um, and we have actually two types of chamois cream. We have a, an ultra ride cream and a, a pro ride. This was actually developed uh, for like 24 hour racing, endurance racing, people that do a heck of a lot of miles on their bike. Um, and what's unique about it? I mean, everybody's got a cream. Okay, so these have uh, unique products that are only available in New Zealand, uh, Manuka Honey. Uh, which is actually has special antibacterial uh, properties. We also have manuka oil, uh, we have uh, almond oil, uh, a number of other waxes and things, all natural derived from plants. You know, so. And so this one here is like a general purpose one, it's pretty much the same as anything else that's on the market, just perform equal to all of those. This one here is the real performance one. All right, cool.
All right, you guys, so hopefully that gives you some education on a different type of wax or application for your chain. If you have any questions, make sure you comment below. If you're not following us on our different properties, go to cyclingstrong.com, go to Facebook, wherever it is. Get involved in the group, start having the conversations with other people. You'll find out a lot of stuff. So get out there, most importantly, and ride your bike and have a great day.